Good afternoon, John Glenn. It's Monday, March 1st, 2021. Happy birthday today to Raymond Kane and tomorrow to Jaden Rimbaugh and Braxton McNeil. Be a Rosie reader. Rosies are a list of 20 t titles selected as the best for the school year's readers. There is something for everyone. Read and give a rating of one to five stars for at least two of the titles and earn a candy bar. Read and rate at least five titles by April 15 and qualify for a pizza lunch. See the media center display for details. There will be a meeting for all freshmen, sophomores, and juniors interested in taking AP and dual credit classes from both Trine and Ivy Tech for the 2021-2022 school year on Wednesday, March 3rd in the auditorium. You will get information about these classes. You will also have time to ask questions. Freshmen and sophomores will meet during the first activity period and juniors will meet during the second activity period. Please plan to attend this important meeting. Now here's weather with Sophie. So we have a high of 39. It's mostly cloudy with a real feel of 26 with a northwest 13 mile per hour wind speed and excellent air quality. Now for the three day. Tuesday we have a high of 42, sunny with a low of 31. Wednesday, a high of 49, partly cloudy, low of 26. And then Thursday, a high of 43, sunny with a low of 25. Now back to the main desk. Thank you, Sophie. Here's a reminder to the students that they need to have a student parking tag if they drive to school. We will have a special performance for just John Glenn High School students on March 11th at 7.30 p.m. Students may purchase tickets in the theater office during the lunch period or after school. Tickets are $10 and seating is limited due to COVID protocols. Now here's sports with John and Payton. Stifling defense and an effective offensive night led Glenn to an impressive 50 to 29 win over the visiting Goshen team on Friday night. Glenn's balance was on display in the second quarter on both ends. The team's defense held Goshen scoreless in the second frame and almost 11 total game minutes to distance themselves and secure the victory. Glenn will meet the winner of Washington and Jimtown next Friday at Washington for a 6 o'clock tick-off. Now back to the main desk. That's all for you guys today, Falcons. Have a great day.